What is happening, Magnusites? Just got back from seeing the Incredibles Dulce. And like I said, I had a great time watching that movie. It was very enjoyable. The animation was beautiful. The way they were just designed was great. And you know, I mean, they, they just, just the detail in them was off the chain. Um, funny as usual. Okay, funny family moments, couple moments, neighbor moments. The superhero moments, superhero versus villain moments, just this it was a really I had a really good time. I just I just I remember just sitting there with a smile on my face the majority of the time. Just like it did have some low points, had some slow points, um that I, I don't remember the first movie sharing. But anyway, so basically the story is, is going to revolve around the Incredibles, you know who they are. And, uh, superheroes get outlawed, but there's a group that wants them to not be outlawed. Two steps forward to help Frozone, um, who's badass, by the way. Damn, the way they did his ice in this was, oh, was, you know, it was, yeah, you know, I love the way he was badass in this. But step forward to Frozone and had, you know, wanted, and wanted to talk to, you know, um, Mr. and Mrs. Incredible about getting things moving and getting superheroes unbanned and they end up choosing and you've seen this in the trailer basically they end up choosing Mrs. Incredible you know because um Elastigirl is not as uh she's more cost effective than Mr. Incredible he leaves too much damage <laughs> in a way so the you know the rest of the movie is basically you know you you're gonna have these moments because Mr. Incredible's home with the kids, so you can imagine she's out fighting crime, so you can imagine you know the type of stuff that's gonna go on here. Um, all the voice acting was great. I thoroughly enjoyed myself, but I did not enjoy this as much as the first one. Maybe I need to see it again, but I didn't enjoy it as much as I did the first one. And wait till you see how many powers the baby has. Wait till you see. Just wait. We've all seen him in the trailers do stuff. Wait till you see. It's nuts. <laughs> so I'm going to give this three and a half out of five. Woo's. Okay. Um, I enjoyed myself, but I found myself bored in certain areas, but I, I still enjoyed myself. It was not a bad movie. It wasn't great, uh, but it wasn't a bad movie. I enjoyed myself. I was smiling, but there were times where I was kind of just like, you know, I found myself a little bored or my mind wandering. And, um, you know, that takes a little bit of points off, but it's still a good movie. Some, some of you are probably going to absolutely love it and think it's better than the last one, you know what I mean? Everyone's got their opinion. Post comments down below. Let me know what you thought, though. If you enjoyed my movie review, hit the like button, subscribe, and share. If you did not, that's fine. You can kiss my black Incredibles loving derriere. 10 million subscribers. Woo! You may now subscribe.